What is up, guys, and welcome back to another great episode of NCA 06 Race for the Heisman. We have our boy Daniel Mock, wide receiver at Texas A&M in his freshman year. We are here in his dorm room. Let's take a look at where we currently are with this series, guys. We're in his freshman year, like I said, and we are in week 11. We are currently 5-3, and three, trying to become bowl eligible with another win. we got to get to six wins if we want to be able to go to a bowl. We have lost three of our last four games, guys. So we really need to start getting some things going. And it's not going to get any easier with our schedule. We have number 20, Texas Tech, number one, Oklahoma, and then number eight, Texas. So it's going to be really difficult to get a win, but I believe we can at least get one win. Look at what's going on in the dorm room, guys. If you didn't see my last episode, I did get a new girlfriend. So that is exciting. Got a nice piece of arm candy right there. And then another big thing that is going to happen in this episode is that we are going to finally go over a 1,000 yards receiving. That is quite an accomplishment for Daniel Mock being a freshman, getting over a 1,000 yards receiving. He already has 14 touchdowns. One quick thing before we start today's game, guys. If you are new, please hit that like and subscribe. We are on the road to 1,000 subs. Thank you so much for being here. Hey, football fans. Brad Nessler here with my partners in crime, Lee Corso and Kirk Herbstreit. No complaints about the weather tonight as we see nothing but stars in this contest between the Texas A&M Aggies and the Texas Tech Red Raiders. We're delighted you could join us today for this late season push for bowl bids and conference positioning. Here come the Red Raiders. If you compare these teams on paper, they really look to be pretty equal. Kirk, what do you think? Texas Tech has a sensational quarterback on their side who's a true leader. I think his presence on the field gives them a slight advantage. And Lee, I think that's going to be the difference in an extremely close game. I know everyone has been waiting. It's time for my pick. The Red Raiders, sweetheart. That's who I'm picking. All right, guys, here we go. We got the Texas A&M Aggies on defense. Since Texas Tech likes to throw the ball so much, we're basically just going to be playing a lot of cover three today. Big play right here. Let's see if we can get a three and out. Third and nine. Thank you. Yes. Got some pressure on this quarterback. Had to throw it sooner than he wanted to. Punt. If we want to have a chance today, we got to play mistake-free football. And we have to be a balanced team. We have to be able to run it and pass it. Ooh, span the wrong way. Not leaving anything to chance on second inches, man. We're just bringing the goal line set in. Get the first. There you go. Coleman gets it. Ooh, it might be fourth and inches. It is. We're going to go for it. We're going to give it to the fullback right. There we go, baby. We're not getting stopped on this drive. Get Daniel open. Oh, he dropped it. Big play. Yes, Mark. Go, 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 go. Yes, inside the 10. Third and goal, ball on the four. Try to throw it two times. Two incomplete passes. See if we can get it in with the option. Oh, there's nobody even out here. Good job. All right, D, come on. Let's just keep doing what we're doing, baby. Keep this defensive game plan going. We got a three and out on that last drive. Yes! Boom! Huge sack. Second and 17, they're able to get it all the way to third and one. They're going to run it right here. Come on. Third and one, of course they're going to run it. Yes, another stop by this Aggie defense. Yeah, that's right, baby. We got your number, boy. Here we go. Need to increase this lead right here. We did a good job of mixing it up on that last drive with throwing and running. Over the middle, Wheeler, nice catch. Ooh, go, Mock, go. Nice catch down the sideline. Ooh, Wheeler with another nice grab down at the five. Ooh, hoo, hoo, hoo. Mock put up his hand, wanted it. We gave it to him. Playing phenomenal right now. Two three and outs, and the offense has gone down and gotten touchdowns. 
Everything is going according to plan right now. Oh, nice diving catch by who is that, Bobo? Here we go, D. Let's get a stop right here. Third and two, play man. Oh, wow. See ya. Dude, the guy is ridiculously fast. We let him get to the corner and he was gone. Let's just keep doing what we're doing, oh. Ain't broke, don't fix it. First down, Coleman. But that boy Lake is really doing it all. Need a big play right here. Third and ten. We do not want to give the ball back to this Texas Tech offense. Underneath, Wheeler, first down. Yes. Ooh, spin move with Lake. Go up the field. Nice. Oh, this is going to be a touchdown right here. We got way too many blockers going to the outside. Well, it should have been. They played that really well. Might as well go for it. We're kind of in no man's land. We could punt it, but I'm going to see if we can get anything deep or just run it with our legs with Lake. And I'm just going to take this clock all the way down. Oh, let's just go for it, Lake. Woo! Get that first. Let's call a timeout. It's going to be the last play of the half. Looking for some time. Wow. Didn't even get a chance to throw it deep. Unfortunately, we weren't able to get anything going to end the half, but at least we get the ball to start the second. Ooh, Coleman. Finding a way to get that first. Let's go, Mock. Get a little screen to you. Pick up some nice yards. We got to get rid of the ball faster than that leg. Takes a huge sack. Third and 20. Let's see what we got here. Dude. I don't know what he was doing, but he should have kept running straight down the field instead of going to the sideline. That should have been a first down. It's unfortunate we weren't able to take advantage of the two offensive series we had before this Texas Tech offense hit the field because it is still a 14-7 game. Thank you, Rose, providing the pressure. Get one more stop, D. Come on, please, please. Thank you. Good job. All right, oh, come on. Seriously, we need to get down there and score a touchdown right here. We cannot expect our defense to hold this Texas Tech offense all game. Yes! Way to fit it in there. Dude, Wheeler's having himself a great game. There we go, Lake. Woo! Nice running with the option, baby. Third and two. We're just going to keep running it, baby. Got to get that first. Oh, just barely. Mock! Keep going, keep going, keep going. We got the first. Yes. We'll tell you right now what's about to happen. I'm about to take the ball. I'm going to run it to the right with Lake, and then I'm going to throw it to Mock again like I did last time for his other touchdown. Never mind. Get it out to Coleman. Touchdown. They were blitzing. Had to get it out to him early. 21-7, to baby. We got 15 seconds left to go in the third. Ooh, Okay. Breaking tackles, getting a first down. I see you, Jones. Thank you. Get that pick. Oh, with the spin. You want that? You like that? You like that, baby? Finally, the defense gets a turnover, and we make them pay with the pick six, 46 yada. This game has been phenomenally played, and I might as well say coached. It is 28-7 right now, and Texas Tech is a good team. They're number 20 in the nation. We're hitting out there with Butler. Yes, another pick. Ooh, Williams, keep going, baby. Keep going. You know what? I thought that was going to be a user pick. They don't give me the user pick, but I'll still take that interception, man. 
Nice, dude. We're about to just pour it on these guys. We don't have to get it all. If we get a couple yards, great. If we get nothing, that's okay, too. We're still in field goal range. Oh, Coleman. I did not even see him. I was going for Kendrick. Wow. When it rains, it pours, man. I don't even know where Coleman came from. I think he was in the middle of the field. 35 to 7, guys. Wow. I did not expect this to be the score in the fourth quarter. Ooh, so close. All right, guys, we got to tackle that running back. We already know how fast he is. Ooh, get him down. Ooh, all right. Nice tackle by number 20. Throws a duck while getting hit to Allen. Number 10, Mark Jacobs appears to be injured on that play. Are they actually going to give it? No, there's still play action. Yes! We get the sack, baby! Fred Jody's excited on the sideline. Man, if we get a stop right here, our defense truly did something special today. Get him down, Rose, with the user sack, baby. We dropped everybody back in coverage. He had nowhere to throw the ball. Let's have some fun. 34 seconds left to go in the game. See if we can get some more points. Game is over. Let's just run the clock out. Get the blocks out there, Coleman. Get you upfield. Don't get out of bounds, though. Mock is pulsating. Lake is pulsating. Let's see if we can hook up with each other one more time. Ooh, now that boy Mock is glowing red too. I think he's ready to make a play. Oh, way to come down with it, dude. Padding the stats, baby. Yes, sir. Let's see if we can get a touchdown right here on the option. I'm not going to call a timeout. No more time left to go on the clock. Scored a touchdown just to put insult to this win. That's right, baby. Putting salt on the wound. Y'all get out of here. Go get drunk on campus or something. Ooh, what a game, baby. 41-7. to seven. What's your final thought on the game? I can't say enough about this performance. Texas A&M looked like a team on a mission to destroy anything and everything that got in their way. Brad, this is a really good-looking football team. Folks, That's it's been a lot of fun, of and I hope you can join us again next time. Our final Texas score on this one, Texas A&M, 41, Texas, Texas, Texas Hey, there's our boy Mock, finally getting some animation time. Talk about a phenomenal game, guys. We played absolutely amazing. That is probably the best game we've played all year against a quality opponent. Looking at stats, Daniel Mock, six catches, 117 yards, and one touchdown. Wheeler, four for 91. Coleman, two for 30 and two touchdowns. Kendrick, one for four. Bishop, he must have had a drop. Yes, he did. And Daniel Mock also had a drop. After that phenomenal win, guys, let's go ahead and check the fan mail. Welcome, Daniel. A lot of freshmen come in here and get lost in the shuffle, but not you. From the day you set foot on campus, you have seemed determined to distinguish yourself as a future Heisman contender. Keep it up. Nikki Kovacs. Go ahead and look at that newsletter as well. Fighting for survival, number 22 Texas A&M set to do battle with number one Oklahoma in a Big 12 showdown. So we are actually ranked again. That is nice to see. Let's see if we're back on that Heisman watch after that great game. Yes, we've gone up to number two. I don't see how we bounce around so much. That's pretty ridiculous, actually. We're the only wide receiver in the Heisman watch right now. Just over 1,100 yards. Well, guys, let's go ahead and get this game going. Number one, Oklahoma at Oklahoma. Welcome, everyone. Brad Nessler here for EA Sports with my co-host, Kirk Herbstreet, and the coach, Lee Corso. 
The Mercury will stay low today in this game between the Texas A&M Aggies and the Oklahoma Sooners. This appears to be a heck of a late season matchup. They're playing today in hopes of impressing the pollsters and the bowl reps. And here come the Sooners. The Sooners seem to have the better team. They should win this game. What do you think, Kirk? Oklahoma has a big advantage on the offensive side of the football, and that's their quarterback. And the thing that I've noticed about him that makes him so special is his composure on the field. He's the reason they win this game big. I've been quiet about this, but I think it's finally time for my pick. Boomer Sooner. Okay, here we go, guys. Playing the number one team in the nation. I really don't know what to expect here. With that win over Texas Tech, we are now bowl eligible, and that's really all I wanted to accomplish my freshman year. Um, but we'll see what we can get here. Tackle for loss by me. Heck, we got a chance to get a three and out right here. Third and 11. Oh. Ooh, lucky that you went out of bounds. I missed the sack. He goes out of bounds. Everything still works out. I don't want to have a three and out as well. Come on, let's get the first down right here. Wheeler, yes. Ooh, let's just go around out here. Oh, yeah. Mock one on one. It hit him in his helmet. Oh, my gosh. You think you're a Heisman candidate? Come on, dude. Yes, sir. Look at that wide open Graham. Oh, spinning out there. Give him the stiffy. Yes, inside the 10. Dude, we are rocking and rolling, playing the number one team in the nation right now. Be as loud as you want, man. I figured out how to kick field goals. I'm not going to miss anymore. Take that early lead. 3 nothing, baby. Defense back out on the field. We got a three and out last series. Let's see if we can do it again. Oh, once again, can't go up for the interception. Ooh. Oh, dang. Okay, he made me look dumb right there. Jeez. Last drive, we had to settle for a field goal instead of punching it in, and Oklahoma made us pay on their drive. We are down 7-3 to three right now. Mock, get open. There we go. Off to the races, baby. Yes. Keep going down the field. Third and long. I'm looking for Wheeler right here. He dropped it. Wheeler, you did that route so well last week. That's a first down, my man. So when you play the number one team in the nation, you got to keep it close. Got to keep it close to the fourth quarter. Somebody pick it off. Somebody pick it off. No, Ingram again. Are you kidding me? Third and 10, using that big body frame to shield our DB to make the catch. Man. That's fine. Ingram again, dude. He is like their go-to guy. Let's see if we can establish the run right here. We really need to score before the half. Coleman. Ugh. Only able to get one. Wheeler, we're going to go right back to you. The play that you dropped the ball earlier on, we're going to hit you again. You better catch it. Golly. Dude. I guess I just kind of reined myself into that sack. We had a good pocket, and I just went to the outside, and I didn't have to do that. I could have sat there and fired it from inside the pocket. Yes, I got my own sack, baby. User, the user, the user. Oh, 
man, I thought I was going to get a sack. He ends up completing the pass down the middle. Kick is on its way. Yeah, that's good. Go! Yes! Woo-wee! Let's keep it up, boys. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Oh, I'm not able to get out of bounds. I don't have any more timeouts, and that's how it's going to end. Halftime, guys. Oklahoma 10, Texas a and 3. Getting into the second half, guys. We have the ball, but we had a fumble on the kickoff. That's why we're stuck here at the 4. Come on, Wheeler. I need you right here. Make the catch. Thank you, man. We got that route all day. First down. Dude. Come on, man. That linebacker should not be able to make that play. I'm throwing to a guy that's like 10 or 15 yards behind him, and I'm putting air under it. Let's watch this replay. Like, seriously. Able to tip it. Come on. Short toss, yes! Get the stop! Woo, took a while, but Mock got open. What does he got here? Receptions in a season 66. That's a new school record. Why, why, why? We cannot get a break, man. For whatever reason, we're just not catching any breaks in this game. Nice open field tackle, Hall. Ooh. Oh, wow. Juke that led to just a wide open end zone. Look at this. Little option. Pitches it out. Juke. Get the block. Uh-oh. No one's there. Now, serious, guys. We really need to score a touchdown here. Uh, there's only 11 seconds left to go in the third. Oh, my gosh. I'm about to get hit again. Dude, where are these guys coming from? Come on, Mock. We got to have a big play. We need 15 yards. We're going deep to you. Why? Why can we not make that connection? Why are we overthrowing him? D, we have to get a three and out. There's not enough time. Boom! Use a sack by yours truly. Oh my gosh. There's a lot of room over there, man. That's a fast dude. You know, usually you'd think they would kick a field goal, punt it. No, they are going for it. They're going to end it right here. Are you kidding me? Look at me. I come free, blitz, hit him. And they just throw a little loft pass over my linebacker for the touchdown. Maybe that's my problem. Maybe I've been throwing the ball too hard. Maybe I just need to tap it so that it just falls in there. Maybe that's the problem. That's what we'll do here. Ha! Got tipped. Come on, loft it over. Thank you. Okay. I guess that's what we got to do, man. We just got to have these little air raid throws to drop them right behind the defense. That was nice. We're going to give it our best shot right here. <laughs> Figured that might be able to bounce off somebody. Wow, actually, we got player of the game. I had five catches for 179 yards. 
This is it. Third and inches. If we don't get a stop here, it's over. Ooh. Way to hang in there, D. I like it, man. We got a little fight in us. And it's good. Increasing their lead by 17, 27 to 10. Heck, might as well throw it deep again. It's only 22 seconds left. Ooh! You've got to be kidding me. Oh, my gosh. Oh, of course. There's a flag. I probably went out of bounds. Yep. Legal touch. Come on, Lake. You got to be able to put the ball in the field of play. That's it. That's all she wrote, man. 27 to 10. You know what? They are the number one team in the nation, so I don't feel too bad about it. We did get a victory earlier in this episode, so I'm happy with that. We are bowl eligible. Nice, nice win for this football team. And we thank you kindly for taking part in NCAA Football 2006. Our final tally in this game, Oklahoma 27, Texas A&M 10. So for Lee Corso and Kirk Herbstreet, this is Brad Nessler saying goodbye, everybody, and thanks for tuning in. Receiving on the day, Daniel Mock, five catches, 179 yards, one touchdown. Just think how many yards he would have had if we actually caught that ball inbounds and scored a touchdown. He would have had like 260 on the day with two touchdowns. Wheeler, two for 38. McCowan, one for five. And Graham, one for 53. Looking at drops, Wheeler, and again, Mock had another drop. All right, back in the dorm room. Let's take a look at the fan mail this week. To Daniel, you truly are a freshman sensation. If the rest of the country knew how good you would be from day one, there's no doubt you would have been on the Heisman watch list. I couldn't be happier that you signed with us from Chris Dangerfield. Well, uh, I was on the Heisman list. I've been on the Heisman list a couple times. I guess they took me back off. Looking at the newsletter, what do they have now time to play Lone Star Showdown pits number 25 Texas A&M against number five Texas looking at the Heisman watch this week probably means we're not on it no we're still on it but our stock is going down probably the best game I've had all year and my stock goes down because well we lost and that's fair well, guys, that's going to do it for me. Thank you so much for being here and watching. Again, if you're new, please hit that like and subscribe because we are on the road to 1,000 subs. Next episode, guys, we are going to be going up against number five Texas and then playing in a bowl game. And then, heck, man, freshman season's over. On to sophomore year. I'm out.